but today in a new team. How's he going to get on? Well, follow it with us, and it's live. Hi, everybody. Big welcome to you all to Manchester, to the Etihad Stadium. And it's Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler. And your Manchester City. And today, it's Manchester City against Huddersfield Town. Well, the champions in front of their own supporters after the first game. And it's a wonderful feeling for the players providing the trophy beforehand. So much hope for this season now as well. And uh, I think, rightfully so, they're going to be in for a good campaign. Coming up against a team that, uh, well, I think it might be a tough old campaign for them. And away from home, what a bonus it would be if they could pick up a point or maybe more. Riyad Mahrez. Number 10, Sergio Aguero. And number 19. Manchester City's lineup today. Kevin De Bruyne starts. He was man of the match in his last game. Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. have this team at their disposal today well, we put it up and what looks Alan very defensive but there's flexibility isn't there in the side yeah and I think with his shape so much depends on the wing backs how much they are allowed to get forward and what they can do when they do get forward Manchester City a good side they look at the moment they won away their last game against Arsenal yeah good good solid 2-1 victory and enough talent within this team to get another victory today. And the ball played to Mendy. Chance for back-to-back -back wins for the new manager, having been successful in his second game in charge. Here's game number three, and beginning to take shape under him. I think so. I mean, there were signs that he's getting the players on side, and... Another win here, the crowd will be right behind him. And here's the shot. Goal for De Bruyne. Oh, that sheer class from the Belgian. He's so elusive when he gets on the ball. And it's a top finish here, though. Know? It's a very good goal. I think they were a bit caught out because that's supposed to be his weaker foot. And they, they kind of just switched off for a moment. Yeah, and look at the way he did take it. Maybe he's been working on that weaker side on the training ground. He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that, but his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Manchester City are in the lead. Manchester City goal. Number 17, Kevin De Bruyne. Here's Alex Pritchard. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. And he takes it on. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. The header on target. Good vision here. Mares onside. He's in now. Up for grabs here. Off the post. Sane. And we have a corner to come via that deflection. Yeah, the crowd sensing momentum is with their team here. David Silva. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they've still got the ball. In with the header, and a good position, but he's put it wide. Yeah, it's a good chance. Not sure if that came off his shoulder, you know. Didn't look a clean connection. Aguero. That is Silva. And here's the shot. Oh, charged down. And that's half-time. Signaled by the referee, 1-0 the half-time score. I guess, Alan, we're getting what we expected to this point. Yeah, and quite often you do get a shock in these circumstances, but you've got to hand it to the favourites. They've, uh, they've made their superiority. Sergio Aguero now. Here's the chance to get in the cross. It's De Bruyne. On to David. And shoots! Good stop by the goalkeeper. Good support play from his teammates. Trotto! That is 
is a startling save. That's all about reactions and agility. Corner now for Manchester City. Could whip it in from here. Kyle, shots on here. No troubles there for Lerslinger. Now Williams. Today's man of the match. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Kevin De Bruyne. Here's the chance. The shot cuts off. Remarkable. They've equalised against the balance of the match, but recognising the need that they had to push extra players on to try and find a way through and they've conjured up a goal out of very little in, in truth but no wonder they're celebrating and here we are level again it's a change here and i think it might be a tactical one there will be a minute uh, level both sides have scored here now slipped through by aguero and he scores spectacularly well he's only been on the pitch matter of minutes i'm not sure he's touched the ball before this but a vital touch there to score it's a great moment for the goal scorer and for his team it surely won the game in the dying moments it must have and it was a really good take as well didn't have much time in the box there We had seemed to be stuck in a, a bit of a stalemate, in truth, but this very, very late goal has changed that. Well, they threw men forward and they've got the reward. Final whistle, it's Manchester City's match. They kept right on to the end of the road and a happy ending. Not much to split the two sides, but I think the winning team just about deserved it. A shining light for his side today was Raheem Sterling. Well, he was arguably his team's best player, so I think it was fitting that it was him just when his team needed him to grab that light winner. It's match time. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith with you as always to describe it. And we're looking forward to something special today. Eh? Well, I think so, Martin. I hope these two teams won't disappoint us. Our match today is Wolverhampton Wanderers against Manchester City. A chance to have a really good look at Manchester City. Well, this team has started like champions, haven't they? We all expected them to be at the end of it, but two wins out of two. They've certainly announced their intentions to the rest of the teams in this division. Such an important position in the modern game, uh, at full-back, and they've strengthened, haven't they, with this signing? Yeah, and I think you're always looking for athleticism when you're looking at your full-backs, and this is a player that can get up and down all day. 
Manchester City. A real spring in their step on the back of that home win in their previous game against Huddersfield Town. It's quite close, that 2-1 victory, but uh, they just edged through and probably do the same here. the way Wolves are set out for this vital fixture. Rui Patricio starts in goal, João Moutinho starts, looking to recover his form. And they're going to go with one striker up front. Manchester City's lineup today. Looking at the lineup, he's got all the components in place, hasn't he? The manager for the pressing style of play has been a feature of his team. Yep, and uh, many an opponent has found it difficult to cope with. If your touch isn't spot on against this aggressive type of closing down, you're going to lose it in dangerous areas. The buying club will too, because £40 million pounds around that. And shoots! Manchester City get a corner. Nicholas Otamendi. Well, now there's a chance to attack from the tackle. Jimenez. In with a chance. Oh, good save. And he's clung onto the ball as well. De Bruyne. Here's Fernand. Has a go here. Well, that was so close to going inside the post, but it's just straight past the outside. Yeah, I think he'd beaten the keeper, you know, but just not got it within the framework of the goals, and he's a bit unlucky. And in it goes. Still heading for goal. And he did well to get to the ball first. Tight scenario here on the ball. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. That was uh, the half-time whistle. And one side really will be thinking they should be ahead here. Yeah, fascinating contest because you look at the two sets of teams, not much to choose, but uh, one team is on top here. It's Manchester City to start this second half. Gabriel Jesus. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Shot off. Well, that's the opener. And it's been coming. The better side... But you have to score when you're on top. We wondered whether they would do that, but they have done. And they've done it in fine style. Replay confirming for us here that the goalkeeper did get a touch, but not strong enough to keep the ball out of his net. Well, he is his own harshest critic, this lad, and he'll blame himself for that, I think, having got a touch. Manchester City in front. Manchester City goal. Number 17, Kevin De Bruyne. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Oh, it's a tremendous goal. No goal. Flag up. Well, that assistant there, he was certain the flag went up straight away. They've spread it out wide here. Gets his cross in. Great contact with the header. Great work from the keeper. Now Fernandinho, and here's the shot, really at the extent of his reach to make that very fine stop. Manchester City get given the corner here. But here comes the corner. Excellent header, millimetres away from scoring, really. I think he thought he had scored, and maybe the keeper did too. Coming off the pitch. Number 20, Bernardo Silva. His Jota. Jimenez. Another shot. Edison with an easy save. Finished the job. And shoots. Here's a chance from the corner. Substitution for Manchester City. And off the pitch. Number 16, Ryan. To the replace for Sais. Now Doherty. Manchester City get the result here they wanted. They've won. 
Well, that sort of win is really satisfying because they've had to give body and soul to get it. Yeah, it was a really close call, but uh, there's a lot of those players produced the best out there and they deserve that win. Through the highways, till my shadow turns to sun rays. 